Hallo ihr Lieben und herzlich Willkommen zu unserem neuen YouTube-Video. Ich stehe hier in Karlstad in Schweden vor einer Kathedrale und warte auf meinen schwedischen Kollegen Patrick. Hallo Lotte. Hi, nice to see you. Nice to see you too. So you want to present me your new project in Sweden? Yes, so you're excited to see it. Yes, of course, let's okay. go inside. Okay, yeah, let's go. This cathedral in Karlstad, it's the third one built in this place because the two previous ones were burnt down. It has been renovated and refurbished many times and now it was time for the electrical part. So all the control units are El Taco devices. So let's talk to the installer. I'm standing in the cathedral in Karlstad and with me I have the installer Henrik from Göriel. Welcome. Thank you. So tell me, Henrik, uh, why did you choose El Taco devices for this project? I chose El Taco. I, I was searching for a product and a brand that are uh, future-proof and uh, that have uh, the possibility to dimmer larger loads. Yeah, that's true, because uh, we have the possibility to build our dimmers so we can make huge, large dimmers for larger loads. Yeah, I like the idea with the prefabricated power distribution box yeah. because uh, in a church it's always fully booked and they have lots of activities. Um, how long did it take for you to make the change here on site? Uh, the change here on site took uh, one day. One day only, yeah, yeah that's really good. Yeah. Um, I know you prefabricated at your site the, the power distribution box. Yeah. Uh, how long did it take to make the installation uh, there? Uh, it took about uh, three days, I think. Mm, yeah, it's a lot of things to yeah. handle, yeah. yeah. Thank you very much, Henrik. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. With all the actuators positioned in the, this power distribution box down in the basement, uh, we have the possibility to control them here with wireless push buttons, which are battery free. That uh, is very good for the environment. And uh, we have possibility to control each lighting individually, or we can also uh, put up scenes that we have different scenes for different themes that they have inside the church and also change the color depending on the mood. So um, let me uh, show you some uh, examples. If I want to dim up the lighting, I only push one button and we have the scene with the higher uh, dim level and uh, then I can turn it down again and then I can also change the colors that we have on top of the pillars. So for example, we can have a red color and we can make it really red all depending on the mood and uh, what type of uh, lighting you want to have here. And now we are here at uh, Ny Eds church in Molkom. Uh, this church was burnt down twice uh, due to uh, lightning and uh, it was rebuilt and now they have upgraded it with uh, El Taco wireless devices for controlling the lighting. Uh, let's have a look and uh, talk to the installer. Here we are using the El Taco devices to control the lighting. Uh, what do you think was the benefits of using El Taco devices here? Um, the benefits here was that uh, we had trouble with um, uh, cable routing mm -hmm. uh, because we have a lot of uh, lighting groups. Instead of having to put one cable at each button, we can use the wireless solution. Yeah, of course, and the wireless then it doesn't need any wire, so that's really good. Yeah. I also see that you have the wireless scenario push buttons here. Yeah, yeah, it's it's a really good um, preferred with when you have a lot of stuff at place. Yeah. So so they can program their own scenarium scenarios. Yeah. yeah, that's really good. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, let's have a look at it. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Yes, Henrik, now we're up here and uh, we have the scenario push button. Yeah. Um, can you please show us how to change the scenario? For example, this chandelier, if I want to have this uh, up dimmed a bit, yeah. how, how to do that? Then I'm going to look at this map that I made uh, and check what button is controlling that. So I know it's number one. So I hold the button up and I push 
the scene button for six seconds or more. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then we get the confirmation with the little dim. Mm -hmm. And now I know that this chandelier is on this scene. Okay, that was really easy. Yeah. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. We've come to the end of our YouTube video. I want to thank you for watching and especially I want to thank you for showing us your projects. Yeah, thank you very much for being here and uh, looking at our projects. We have had two projects here with churches in Sweden. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to comment or send a message. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye.